Good morning, everyone. So, it's not lost on me about the lighting. I'm very amused by this. But it is 4.48 in the morning. And you know what? Time is a pain in the butt. Why did we ever come up with the concept of time? I used to get up and go journal. Go read a book and play around online. Because of something, I'm going to have to will the heck out of getting all three of those things in my repertoire again. I just... Ugh. The whole point of getting up early is to go ahead and get myself set for the day. So, and don't worry, I still do my mudras and things like that, which is awesome. No, not sacred yoga, but mudras. So, I'm going to have to... That's my next project. Getting back into doing those things or at least picking one of those and following through with it. I mean, heck, that's almost two hours. And I'm sitting here going, I can't get anything done. What is that? So, I'm not chastising myself. I'm investigating myself and witnessing this going, wait a minute, what just happened? <laughs> it's probably because I like drinking my coffee and just going, oh, I'm awake now. <laughs> Who knows? Okie dokie. So this day is going to progress. We're going to have fun because we're the ones who make it what it is. So be your lovely selves and I will speak to you later. Bye. Good morning. Good morning. It's almost 1030 now. All right. So ladies, when, when, if you work in the food industry, okay, um, you sometimes have to deal with the fryers. So I have been wearing double gloves and you know, the big arm sleeve glove that, well guys, you too, sorry. Um, big gloves, so that way, you know, you can clean out the fryer. And one of the things that kept just pissing me off, cause I want to start getting my nails done, except for when I have inspection and then pray the bosses don't come in. Anyway, um, yeah, I know I'm giving myself away, totally. But, so I started wearing, four gloves earlier this week and I have saved my nails so anytime I'm using the greaser or I'm cleaning them out four gloves plus a big glove equals nails not getting messed up which also means I will can keep my fingerprints because you know I bet you ten to one those little suckers are wearing off too met a woman one time who literally you know she much older you know grandma she goes, yeah, the police department, they don't know what to do with me. I kind of looked at her, I was like, what the, what are you talking about? She goes, yeah, they tried to run my fingerprints, didn't ask her why. And <laughs> they couldn't because she didn't have any. She goes, oh, honey, I've been a mama and I cleaned and my kids, they didn't have nothing wrong with them. So I ain't got no fingerprints. I was like, whoa, <laughs> all right, thanks for the chemical warning. So with that, the day keeps going on. Let's see where it goes for now. Hello, everyone. So today was a really good day, all right? One of my friends that I made at Tosa Blue Mountain, she actually stepped out and started making her videos. Hell yes, all right? How does it get even better than that? She's got something to share, and she's going to share it. And as soon as I get her handle, oh, yes, we're going there. We are, okay? Now, the next thing is that today I was telling one of my coworkers, I said, dude, boss was here. Boss asked me a direct question. If you ask me a direct question, I will answer you honestly. For the first time in a really long time, and my best friend can vouch for this, I lied. And I told him, I was like, boss asked me a direct question and I lied. And then about half hour later, I told him, I was like, yep, half hour later, I sent boss a message going, hey boss, I lied to you. I'm so sorry. I did not mean to do that. And I was like, boss only sent over the message saying, um, thank you boss only sent over the message saying, okay, thank you. No worries. I was like, what? That man got forgiveness. Like you couldn't believe. Holy cow. And you know what? I told on myself, I told on myself, I was like, no, you asked me a direct question. 
I'm sorry. So anyway. Oh man, it's been awesome. Awesome. All right, I'll holler at everybody later. Have a good one. Crafts might be in my future. Bye for now. So one really quick, quick thought. Do you ever feel like you're in a Monopoly game? <laughs> everybody wants to own the railroad system now. Cause who is John Galt? Anybody ever read that book? Oh my God with books, this series, even watch the movie. I know the world's gone into some kind of interesting moments, and we're going to get to that. Oh, yeah, because I got something to say. Much love! All right. Again, bye for now. So, I'm not going to lie. Here lately, I've become quite the priss. Um, before... It would be at work going, you know, you're not supposed to wear your fingernail polish. You're not supposed to have done up nails, things like that. Ooh, dragon lair. Dragon lair. Oh, yeah. Okay. And ever since Tosa, ever since my first full body massage, I am nothing but a press. Now, this goes to what's going on in the world today. Ten years ago... Asked the husband. I literally cut my hair short and told him, nah, it was the end of the world. <laughs> when it wasn't, but it sure in the fuck felt that way. I mean, there was this huge energy wave that just was taking me out. And this was in 2010. <clears throat> Mind you, it only been practicing self-ascension for two years. And the whole thing with self-ascension is the level of your consciousness is your veil. And I had just left the firm and I whacked off three feet of hair. And I kept it short up until about five years ago. With that, I am just letting my hair go, let it come down now. You know, yeah, for all you haters out there, I need more of you. Because yeah, I got a big forehead, but so what, all right? Do my glasses show reflection? Yeah. And what? So, <laughs> it's not the end of the world. Okay? Are things changing? Yes. Things are changing quite rapidly because we are in this time. Collectively, we're here. I really encourage you to go over and visit officialshreeandkira.com. I don't care where you start. Just start somewhere. Actually, I do care. Go to the NIM practice, which is navigating the inner matrix, and learn who you are. I've only done that program, and I'll be honest with you, three times. Three times. But I've got the same, I, I, I have a photographic memory and eidetic memory, so I can bring it up, and I'm listening to it, and I'm like, okay, I know where this came from. Boom, let me go get it. So that's to my benefit and not. However... It's nice to not have the mind go in such a huge uproar right now. Are all of the conspiracy theories real? There's a huge possibility for that. Is there more to you than you think? Yes, there is. Did any of the so-called black projects ever end? No. Why do you think 22 some billion dollars is wanted for COVID relief? It is not going to the people. Look, I get it. We're all upset. But you are conscious consciousness. If you give your power away, then you are the one who gave your power away. You are the only presence acting in your world. That's just all there is to it. You are the only presence acting in your world. So it kind of reminds me and brings me back to, who is John Galt? Did anybody ever read Atlas Shrugged? Okay, well, there's a three book series. I know I'm going, I think it's like Atlas Shrugged 1, 2, and 3. I can't remember for sure. This was, this was years ago. But I think it's fascinating how everything's working out. And are you being who you really want to be? Are you? Can you? Will you? Will. Not try. 
Remember, try set you up for excuses. The will to do it, that's the drive. That's the drive. Man, I got a lot to say right now, but it doesn't fit into what I'm just talking about today. Anyway, much love. I will holler at everybody later. Have a good one. Bye for now.